All of these circles are spinning, aren't they? Well, this is actually a still image. Focus on this circle right here and the rest will stop. Optical illusions, or more appropriately known, visual illusions, use patterns, colours and light to trick our brain into seeing things which may not be real. Here are seven optical illusions that will blow your mind. Number one, the Ames Room illusion. You're probably thinking that the person on the right is a giant compared to the person on the left. Or is this person grown in size? Well, not quite. The Ames Room illusion was invented by Adelbert Ames in 1946. The room appears to be a normal rectangular shape from the viewer's perspective. The room, however, is actually a trapezoidal shape. This creates the size different illusion. The person on the left is actually standing further away from the camera, as you can see here. Everything else in the room, such as the windows, are rescaled to make them appear the same size. This means your brain has no other cues to work out the size of the people. This clever trick is also used in the film industry, Lord of the Rings being one of the biggest examples. They manipulated the perspective from the camera to make the hobbits appear much smaller than Gandalf. Number 2. The Ponzo Illusion Both of these yellow lines are the same size, but the yellow line looks bigger, doesn't it? But it's not. It was first discovered in the 20th century by Mario Ponzo. The converging lines trick us into thinking the above line is further away. The further away line would have to be longer to produce retinal images of the same size. Some researchers believe this helps to explain the moon illusion also. This is when the moon appears to be larger when it's near the horizon than when it's higher in the sky. Foreground objects such as trees play the role of the converging lines, tricking us into thinking the moon is bigger than it actually is. Number 3. The Spinning Dancer Illusion Do you see this dancer spinning clockwise or anti-clockwise? The illusion was created by web designer Nobuyuku Kayahara. If you perceive the foot on the ground is the left foot, you will see her turning clockwise, and if it's the right foot on the floor, she will be turning anti-clockwise. After looking at it long enough, it is possible you will randomly perceive that she has changed direction. The reason it's possible for different people to perceive her spinning different ways is because there is a lack of visual cues for depth. This is known as bistable perception. Number 4. The Kinesia Triangle Illusion Without realising it, your brain is creating lines around the white triangle in the middle, isn't it? Lines that don't actually exist. There are in fact no triangles in this image. Even a simplified version, your brain is created a fake image of a triangle in the middle. This is what it looks like when the lines exist, and this is it without the lines. When the real lines are taken away, your brain still creates its own fake lines. It was created by Italian psychologist Gaetano Canizza in 1955. Psychologists have used this to describe the law of closure, which claims objects that are close together are seen as a whole. Our brain ignores the gap and creates familiar objects. Number 5. The Lilac Chaser Illusion Stare in the middle of the screen at the cross. At first you will just see 12 lilac circles with one disappearing at a time. Eventually, the circle that is missing will turn green instead of grey. And if you stare long enough, the lilac circles disappear altogether, leaving just the green circle. This illusion happens for three reasons. The motion of the moving gap is created from the fee phenomenon, where a succession of still images creates apparent motion. The lilac chaser turning green is because of after images. Simply put, when you stare at the same spot, the image continues to appear in your retina. Finally, the lilac discs fade because of a phenomenon known as trochlus fading. Essentially, it states that when you're fixated on one point, surrounding objects which are unchanging will disappear. For another example of this, stare at this cross. Before long, all of the colours will disappear and merge into the grey background. These three factors come together to change your perception from lilac circles 
to a green chasing circle. Number six, the negative photo illusion. Stare at these dots in the middle of this woman's eyes. It'll only take about 30 seconds. Not yet, but when I say go, quickly look at the cross on the right and blink a few times. Nearly there. In three, two, one, go. If you did that correctly, you would have seen the image of the woman in full colour. Remember we mentioned earlier about after images? What you just experienced is a negative after image. The photoreceptors in your eyes became fatigued, causing them to lose sensitivity. As you shift your eyes to the white side of the image, these overstimulated cells continue to send out a weak signal. The fresh receptors surrounding though send out strong signals of the same image as if we were looking at opposite colours. These come together to create the full coloured image. Number 7. The Rotating Boxes Illusion These boxes are not rotating. No really, they aren't. To stop them spinning, focus on a specific area or corner. For example, stare at this triangle. If they were moving, this would be rotating around the back. Or try staring at this corner. When our brains notice things transitioning from light to dark, it is perceived as motion. As the cube's edges alternate from white to grey to black, our brain perceives them as rotating. Mind blown. 